Now, how are they going to be about to divorce yet? She's singing all up in his ear, sounding just like Mariah Carey, sounding so incredibly beautiful. Sounding about as beautiful as she looks. Shout out to Tamar with her pretty self. Anyways, let me go ahead and read to the story from wetpaint.com. They posted a story titled, Update Tamar Braxton Serenades Vince Hubert Following Divorce Rumors. Now, this is posted on July 17th of 2016 at 5 or 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So, Wet Paint wrote the following. When divorce speculation about your marriage becomes a Facebook trending topic, you should probably say something. Tamar Braxton, 39. Wait a second. Tamar Braxton is 39? Why does she look 19? Anyways, Tamar Braxton, 39, decided to sing something. The former real host tried to prove she and husband, Vince Herbert, are doing just fine by serenading her man with Mariah Carey's Always Be My Baby. Pause story right there. I ain't never had a woman sing that shit to me. I'm just saying. I, I, I've had women sing I Hate You So Much Right Now by Khalees. But that's none of y'all business. Anyways, let me go back to the article. <laughs> the article goes on to say, Although Tay Tay, damn, that's a hood ass, ghetto ass name. Excuse me, I don't mean to sound racist for you black folks out there, but I'm brown. I don't know people named Tay Tay. That's a that's a, that's a very coonish nickname. But anyways, although Tay Tay stares lovingly into the camera, her partner seems to be over the stunt and looks anywhere but the iPhone. But one of Vince's pet peeves may be to blame for his disinterest, as opposed to Tamar's rumor cheating. Quote, after all these years, he still hates when I sing in his ears. Tony Braxton's little sis captioned the sweet video. We wish Tamar and Vince many more happy years of getting on each other's nerves. <laughs> oh, wet paint, you ain't shit. <laughs> I mean, really, you ain't shit. So that's a little sound effects for that ass and for my ass no homo the article goes on to say tamar braxton just can't catch a break the braxton family value star 39 is battling divorce rumors less than two months after getting the boot at the reel and everyone's saying she's the cheater wow quote tamar's been cheating on her husband with another high profile man for a while Sources tell lovebscott.com. Vince Herbert, 47, was reportedly suspicious of his wife's extracurricular activities, quote, for quite some time, but only learned the truth when he hired a private detective. The PI uncovered, quote, everything, leading to a blowout argument in front of two other people over the identified side boo. The verbal fight was so tense, Tamar and her husband supposedly, quote, ended up outing everyone in the room a nice little check to keep their lips sealed. <laughs> oh, now that's some tea for that ass. Let me pour this tea down your booty crack one more time. The verbal fight was so tense, Tamar and her husband supposedly, quote, ended up cutting everyone in the room a nice little check to keep their lips sealed. Damn. I wonder what the hell was said now. At first, I was like, well, you know, this is their business and whatnot. It's none of my business. But now I'm like, oh, damn. Now I want to know. I mean, if you cutting people checks, did you imagine what was said? I mean, assuming that that's fact and not just something made up. Somebody could have made that up, but that's pretty crazy. Anyway, the story goes on to say, it seems the couple's little faux pas isn't the end of their problems, since a custody battle could be around the corner. Vince wants sole custody of the duo's son, Logan, three after the divorce. Quote, he doesn't know who Tamar is anymore, a pal claims. Quote, he, he says she's not the same woman he married eight years ago. He has the baby, and that's the only thing he's concerned about. End quote. Although Steve Harvey confirmed last month he's producing a daytime talk show with Tay-Tay, the plan may be nixed so the musician can avoid speaking on the drama. Well, this all sounds like a lose-lose situation for Tamar and every Tamartian out there. Damn. That was posted July 17th of 2016 at 5.05 p.m.
Eastern Standard Time. Or did I say that at the beginning of this video? Anyways, it doesn't even matter. But they, they, they mentioned that at the end of it. So that's why I mentioned it again. Wow, so what is my opinion? This is a damn shame. I'm hoping that they can get on each other's nerves some more too. Oh, shady ass wet paint. Need to name the website wet shit. How dare you? You can't tell me that wasn't some damn shade. Look at the stuff people were saying about them. That they're up there arguing to the point where they got to pay people to shut up about it. Even if this story isn't true. That's interesting. And that's deep. Because you know how they say like, like something is just so juicy, so crazy that you can't make it up? I don't know, y'all. I really don't know. All I know is I hope, I hope, I'm wishing, and I'm praying that the information that I just read to you is just one big, complete, made-up story, fabricated, uh, nonsensical babble. I'm hoping somebody is one big-ass hater who just had it out for Tamar, so they just made shit up. But I don't know about this one, people, because some of the details in the story... Who knows? I, I I can't even call this one. I I just I, all I can say is I, I could just hope, wish, and pray for him. I hope that it's it's just all made up. But anyways, all I know is if Tamar ended up being single again, I'm just saying I'm not wishing anything on their. I'm just saying, not wishing anything on their marriage here. If she did end up being single again, I would be sliding up in her fine ass DMs. Shout out to Tamar Braxton. Shout out to Vince. I mean, I. Please, please let this be a joke. Let me know what you think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine.